Hi guys and welcome back to another plan with me. As promised this week is going to be a sticker list and oh my god was it hard. So I don't know if I mentioned last time me and my husband are going travelling so we're going around the world next year. For India, Australia, Thailand, South America, loads of different places so I'm a bit skin and I can't afford to keep spending £30 every couple of weeks on stickers. So I've got this set, like a monthly set for I think it was £2.85. I've actually forgotten the shop's name so I'll link it below when I've found it. But I thought if I get something that's printable, I can't really afford to stick a paper either but I thought if I just print it on A4, glue it, let's see how it goes. So it is really pretty, I really do like the design. I probably wouldn't ever do anything this decorative but because it came with it, all these full boxes and things like that, I thought I'd just go for it. The worst part of it, and I did it in preparation, I'm not, everything's already cut out. It was the worst bit is cutting it out. It took probably 45 minutes and my hands were absolutely killing me. I had big red marks where the scissors were. So you've got to take that into account. Yes, it'll save you money, but you, it really hurts. Um, I'm using the Life Designer Planner. As you can see, they don't quite fit. It's a very similar size to the Erin Condren and you know, the other ones, so it's not, not massively different. Um, it does overlap slightly but it doesn't bother me because I can just then stick the headers over the overlapping parts of the full boxes. The little checklists don't match with the lines on the thing, that does annoy me a little bit but it's tough. It was £30 for the life designer whereas the Erin Condren and all the accessories and delivery and everything came to like £80 so I don't mind. It's not the end of the world. Um, if you can see I've done my pre-planning on little sticky tabs like I always do so I can write those in after. The other thing that's different with these sets is obviously it's made for the Erin Condren so there's only three different types of headers so you've got your to-do today and your little things. So I decided I'd still rather have the space below but I've sort of improvised in a little bit just to get rid of those extra headers. I think I realise I'm just too sticky, I need to go and wash my hands. So that's the other downside with not having stickers and using glue or print stick or something like that. You're just gonna get all sticky and then you're gonna transfer that all over to your planner and your really nice setup is just gonna be all globby and gross. It actually doesn't look too bad looking at it now, now everything's dried. There's no sort of there's a few little smudgy marks where my globby gluey fingers have got all over it but it's still, it's a lot cheaper than doing it the other way, so it's not too bad. Um, the little hydration stickers at the bottom and then I've got my meal planners. I did try to match the colours originally to the heart checklist so I could have all one day sort of one colour, but that failed because 
I didn't have one that matched the first sticker so I've just sort of mixed and matched and then I've covered over the fourth header with those little boxes so I'm going to put some key things to do on those days and I'm back at work this week as well I've been off poorly I had an operation about five six weeks ago so I've been not enjoying myself but it's been so nice not having to get up in the morning to do anything so unfortunately that can't last forever so I'm back at work this week probably just going to be on a phased return but I'm going to sort of plan in my aim of what shift I'm going to do although I might not manage it and then there's these little hospital stickers doctor type stickers there for because I'm still seeing the district nurse three or four times a week so and I'll just absolutely love that plan sticker it's really cute Like I should have shown you these stickers beforehand, like what they looked like before I'd sort of cut them out and stuff. You do get quite a lot in the set, so all those little, this is just one set and I've got tons left. So you've got your little washing stickers which I've got on Tuesday and Thursday, cleaning stickers, hoovering stickers on the Sunday. I've put date night down on Thursday but I did that by mistake and now it's killing me because I meant for it to be Wednesday. Normally sort of plan one night in advance just that we spend time together and don't do anything with anyone else. And it's meant to be Thursday, Wednesday because we're off Thursday. I'm going to try and stick to doing the same sort of shifts as my husband this week. We work at the same place. So I thought Wednesday might be a nice night to, I don't know, watch a film or do something chilled out. And then there's some little gym stickers. I don't know whether that's going to happen yet. I've froze my gym membership for the last month and I've not been. But even before that, if I'm quite honest, I probably went maybe five times. And I've been a member three months. So, yeah, that's not going to happen. So sidebar, I'm just going to do a few. I love these little habit checklist things. I love doing stuff like that. So I don't know what I'm going to write in them yet. stickers there and some a little checklist for things that I need to buy in the week so the money's going to be what I've spent and what I've saved what I've managed to put away in our travel fund and little scales to see what my weight will be by the end of the week I do need to stop talking out I am way bigger than I should be so the last two times I've done this I've actually written out all my to do's and all my things on camera but it's so messy, I can't do it with a camera there, so I've just decided to fill it in and then I'll show you what I've done after. So I've put in my key tasks sort of in the little squares at the bottom and then filled a few other bits in. So that's everything. So thank you for watching if you watched all the way through and please subscribe for more videos that I've got coming.